So men are at a higher risk of coronavirus infection and they're also more likely to have severe disease and to die from it. And now that we have data from several countries like South Korea, China, uh, United States, Italy and now India, we find that the death rates among men are consistently higher as compared to women. So now why does this happen? Well, uh, one reason people say is because uh, smoking rates are higher among men, which so they already have damaged lungs, which uh, makes the infection more severe. Uh, then men are more likely to have higher rates of chronic illnesses like hypertension, diabetes, heart disease, which uh, uh, again exposes them to uh, more severe infection. So, of course, there are several hypotheses, but, but now we have new research from Kasturba Hospital of Infectious Diseases in Mumbai, which explains why infection rates are higher in men and also why the, uh, the virus, SARS-CoV-2 virus, which causes coronavirus disease, causes more severe infection in men. So what a group of researchers from Kasturba Hospital in Mumbai have found that the testes are reservoirs for SARS-CoV-2, which is the virus that causes coronavirus disease. And there it persists much longer uh, than the rest of the body. So even after the rest of the body has eliminated the virus, the virus persists inside the testes. And, and this doesn't happen with the ovaries in women. So that's one reason why, and, and that's one way how the virus manages to evade the immune system and stay in the body much longer than it does in women. So this is not the first time that viruses has evaded the human body's immunity uh, and there are other precedents from other diseases. For example, the Ebola virus uh, was found to hide in the pigments of, of the retina where it survived for days after patients had recovered. So every day now we're learning something new about the virus and this knowledge is going to add to how we finally fight it, how we find, find the therapies to treat it and how we can help people who are infected recover from it.